Act. Solorzano says Santeria is Christian-based, born from the African religion of the Yorubas and practices of the Catholic faith. Followers believe in God. Yes. It's, it's just we call God different name, but we believe in God. It's the same God. Look, one thing is to be a Christian and still visit shrines for extra protection or something else. Santeria is clearly different from this. Scary to some, endearing to others. So is the bed of the religion that has one of its wings made of Catholicism and the other from the Yoruba traditional religion. This all started during the transatlantic slave trade. If you say you are going to the slave coast during the slave trade, it means you are going to that area that encompasses Bene Coast and Badagri of Lagos coast of today, which were the major slave markets. There's no way termites will build their mound near your house and your house won't serve as their major meal. Same thing is for the Yoruba states that were close to these ports, as much of the slaves that were transported to the New World were of Yoruba origin. Though these slaves had to leave their families and social status behind. Culture, that is something that cannot be isolated from them. So these humans, made into slaves practice their religion, passed it on to their children and bring people into their religion. Gods like Oshongo, Ogun, Oya, Oshun are being worshipped in countries like Brazil, Cuba, just the same way it is done in Yoruba land. Meanwhile, the worship of these gods has taken a new turn modification or let me just say it has taken an eclectic means in its worship of gods by mixing up belief systems of the Spanish Cuban colonial masters with their own tradition. Santerias believe that God is Yorubas alone or Ludumari. Then the other Orishas are God's divine being chosen by God himself to watch over them just as the saints. So. Based on the similarities on the life story of the saints and the life or myths about the Yoruba Orishas, the statues of the Orishas are given their sequencized saints' names. For example, Shongu, god of thunder, is called Saint Barbara. Ogun, god of iron and war, is called Saint Peter. They also believe in Jesus Christ, also known to them as Olofi. Yimaja, a river goddess, is also likened to Virgin Mary. Animal sacrifices are offered to these gods and also, during their ceremonies, they dance to these gods to get possessed by them and speak to other worshippers. Santeria has many worshippers in the Americas and most of their worshippers in Louisiana are Catholics also. Solorzano says Santeria is Christian-based, born from the African religion of the Yorubas and practices of the Catholic faith. Followers believe in God. Yes. It's, it's just we call God different name, but we believe in God. It's the same God. Now, the question is, what are the similarities between these two religions? And why do you think people will decide to combine elements of these two different religions?